let's look at the planets and decide where we want to make our base. Use left shift to fly toward me. I'd use space to go further away. Space to stop that. All right, rotting planet has fungal mode, copper, ammonia, and sodium. I'm tempted to do the original icebound planet that we were on because there are two icebound planets or cold planets and we could take advantage of a single protection to get stuff on both planets and also the ice planets do tend to have both carbon and um, ferrite in good amount This planet See one had zealous sentinels, the other one has enforcing sentinels. What is this little moon here? It's a paradise moon. So you know what? Let's go to the paradise moon. Because that's not going to have any sentinels. And we'll, we'll put our first base on the paradise moon. And we could just walk around looking for salvage data without losing anything on our um, hazardous protection. On a paradise moon, on a paradise planet, the environment is usually nice. this building here that has a landing pad it is free to land to take off from these landing pads so I will build a base near here just to take advantage of that it also looks like there's ferrite and carbon nearby so I'm gonna call this pat I'm gonna name this planet Discoveries. And I'm going to name this Ganga Dizo Paradiso. Weird name, but I'll know what it is. Now, why does it say Sentinels require orthodoxy if it's a paradise planet? Use F to scan the animal. All right, so to make a base, Z, you have 30 chromatic metals, so left click on the base. And then go ahead and place it down. All right, 
So use the base computer with E. Left click. And then click plain base. I noticed it looks like there's carbon close by. Okay, so E to search the base computer archives. Storm sweeping across, but construction supplies low. Depositing shelter plans while need to back soon. So I extract the plans. Now using Z, it te costs 10 carbon to place a floor plan on I'll place that. Now Z, the timber wall is 25 carbon. This is one reason to be collecting carbon. I'll do two sides. Then Z, I'm gonna use a floor panel for the roof. Incoming storm. Okay, F to uh, let's see. Units Often on paradise planets with a lot of trees, ferrites harder to find. Oh, these all require an advanced laser. Pure ferrite. Oh, we didn't replace our launch fuel, so we don't want to go too far away from the plane. All right, go under your, go to the corner. Let's add one more wall. And we are protected from the storm. Oh, wants me to build a timber door. All right, if it insists on building a door, then build a door. I need 10 pure ferrite for that. So I use the refiner. I put 10 ferrite inside. It goes, ferrite goes one to one. I mean, it's not even a real like recipe. You just put the ferrite in there and you get pure ferrite. Okay, we will put the door there. Base computer online. All right, by building the door, it gives me the next thing on the computer. Accessing log from previous Previous user, additional archives recovered. Construction large leaks a success. Recovered salvage data from near bikes. Plans log. Scans indicate additional subterranean devices. Begin search. Extract plans. Whoever recorded these logs evidently had some success. I have access to their plans and perhaps I can learn from their efforts. All right, magnetized ferrite, you, it goes two pure ferrite to one magnetized ferrite. So I will need 40 pure ferrite to make 20 magnetized ferrite. Construction unit will also take nanotubes. 
See if I put the ferrite in there, the pure ferrite, it goes two to one to magnetize ferrite. Okay, and here's the nanotubes. And you notice I don't have to worry about having enough carbon or ferrite because I picked up plenty um, earlier. Okay, and I'll put the construction unit right next to the base. It's easy to find that way. Weather warning. Incoming storm. Okay, let's research buildable technology. I will need two salvage data for the teleport. One for the biofuel reactor. And three for the battery. I had gotten salvage data earlier and I have 10. So, let me take the teleport module, biofuel reactor, free electric wiring, battery. And I ha I, I'm going to take a save beacon. Um, while I'm, I'm going to save the other three salvage. I'm going to um, use C to edit base parts. Left click to move. Move the door. I'll just leave it there. Temperature levels stabilizing. You see, the ground going up prevents me from going through the door. All right, now while we're here, we now have the base teleport module, a battery, which will take 60 magnetized ferrite. So let's, while the storm is going on, let's put the refiner down. We'll need 120 pure ferrite to make what we need for the battery. So go to 120. Technology recharge. Make the pure ferrite while the storm is going on. It's going to ask you to build build a teleport and power the teleport. So we're going to be ready to do that in just a second. Okay, we're also to build We're going to need four metal plates and two carbon nanotubes. So that's going to take like 200 ferrite. So if you didn't collect enough ferrite, you're not going to have what you need to make this stuff. All right, two nanotubes. Each nanotube takes 50 carbon, so you're going to have to have 100 carbon just for what you're going to need to make the base teleport module. Okay, the biofuel reactor. I'm gonna need to make a metal plate for that. So I'm gonna make one more metal plate. And we'll grab the magnetized ferrite for the battery that we're gonna make. And we're gonna need condensed carbon one more. It goes two to one for carbon to condense carbon. All right, let's go to the base computer. It wants you to name it. So I will name this
Gang Paradise Main Base. Okay. So, um, you left click. And then left mouse click to accept. All right, you see on the lower right, it wants me to build a teleporter and then it will ask me to power it. Let's go a little bit away from the building and build the teleporter up here. Otherwise, you'll have your spaceship landing in your house when you teleport. Okay, that's the teleport module. Now you see it says supply power. I like to build a battery first and then the biofuel reactor. Then do a wire from the biofuel reactor green thing to the battery. And then go from the battery to the green power symbol on the teleporter. Then E on the biofuel reactor and add carbon. And actually, let me finish the episode by teleporting gonna tell me to go to the space station and because we went to the space station first we'll be able to teleport there all right accessing log from previous user additional archives recovered entry follows scanner detected unusual broadcast repeating 16 from the space station warning end of archive records interrupted the base computer archives have reached their end it seems there is nothing more I will learn from them. My predecessor appears to have left their base and headed to the space station. Okay, so I will E on the base, um, the teleporter, click space station, Left click and left click to warp to the space station. Okay, I will end the episode here. I'm going to save the game. Thank you for watching.